I see a lot of accidental bites when dogs are reintroduced to friends or family members that they haven't seen in a while. And maybe they had done really, really well with that person for a long time. And then for some reason, they're reintroduced with this person. And the person floods them too quickly. The family lets the dog run up to the person. The person's really excited and expects the dog to recognize them instantly. Dogs don't necessarily recognize faces and voices as clearly as we do. Their memory is related highly to smell. So if you're reintroducing your dog to someone that they haven't seen in a while, for instance, your significant other or family member is in the military and they've been gone for a year and then they're coming home, make sure to tell that person not to engage with the dog. Don't look at the dog. Don't try to pet the dog. Don't talk to the dog. Just let the dog go over and sniff that person for a while and you'll notice a really Really big shift in the dog when they recognize the person through smell. So they'll start out cautious, sniff, 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 and then you'll see the tail go. But if they don't get an opportunity to really recollect that person through their memory and through that smell, very often you'll get a quick snap or a quick bite or something like that because they feel overwhelmed by this stranger to them who's coming on too strong. Let the sniffs happen first and you'll start to see everything else unfold the way that you'd like it to.